A sweet like chocolate. No. Can I just have this yet? No, I love that one. Stop using it. I can't stop. I got a tub version. I'll bring you the tub no. version. No, who wants a tub lip balm? This is what I mean. Mm. Hello. No. Hi, I'm English. Hi, I'm English. That's you. That's you. I don't think so. It's sponsored by Pepsi Max. Oh, There's a Pepsi I'll outside the Coke. <laughs> Right. Hi, I'm Robert Welsh. <laughs> and I'm James Welsh. And this is your weekly reminder that we are not the same persons. We used to do we're not the same person and have like a little thing, but I don't oh. think... Um, not the same person, but we, when... What? Reacting to things. <laughs> Put something there. Clipper. Clipper. Clip anything. <laughs> Hi. Today we are doing something... <laughs> <laughs> no, we've been feeling very reminiscent of the olden days recently, and we were talking about reality shows that we used to really enjoy. Yeah. I feel like back in the day, there was a load of more kind of not like pro- problematic programs, but the stuff that people yeah. used to do and say back in like the early 2000s to mid 2000s. A bit like, what the fuck? Like, you're crazy. crazy. So, we thought we'd react to some old dating shows. Because dating shows back way when were... Do you remember, there was a whole time where MTV was like, how can we make a dating show different to the 20 we yeah. already have? They just kept going and going date and going. Date me sitting on a pencil. Mm-hmm. Date me f- date me farm man. A very good one. Date, date me on a bridge. On a bridge? <laughs> Question? They didn't know where they'd end up. Yeah. But yeah, they did seem to have this thing where they kept trying to outdo every other dating program and put people in weird situations in order to make yeah, the date more interesting. Yeah. So Ash has pulled together some dating... Oh, sorry, but you're meant to be doing this one. I'm fine for you to oh, go ahead. Okay. Well, Ash has pulled together some old dating show clips for us to react to and talk yes. through and hopefully have some fun memories of some of the shows we used to watch. So Ash has put together some clips of some <laughs> dating <laughs> reaction to and hopefully some memories of reaction to them. So let's go ahead. (laughs) Ashton, please. It was a gay dating show. No. Gay dating show, Date My Mum. It was? So I guess with the idea that the mum chooses who the date is? Um, So he dates their mum and then he decides which guy he likes based on the mum. He doesn't meet the mum. He doesn't meet them, he meets the mum. What a good good idea. idea. I'm going to have to do the columns. I get lost looking at all those. That's because you're older than me. Ready? Yeah. Because I know I am. Okay. Sam, he's looking for the boy of his dreams. <laughs> and today he just might find him. But before he does, he'll have to date three moms. Can I just say, this isn't a low quality video. This is exactly <laughs> Like it used to be a little bit better, but it was, it was, pretty it was much. still pretty shit. Mm. It was better than this, but mm. it's still pretty bad quality. Mm. Sam has no idea what their sons look like. He'll only have his impressions of their moms to figure out who's hot and who's not. Oh, he dates their mum. the mums of the... So it's not the yeah. mum dating the men and no, the mum gets to no, choose, right? Date okay. my mum. I used to think, though, it was a kid setting their mum up on dates. Maybe there was a version of that. Yeah, I don't... Date my mum. Mm. They loved, like, doing rock and roll for no reason, didn't they? Yeah. I'm Sam, I'm 22, I'm a makeup artist who loves makeovers. Instant red flag and making noise. Yes. And shouting. And shouting know. and screaming. Do you reckon they were like, just loads of energy? They were. Look at this, shout at this yeah, camera and were. tell us that you're a slut. 100%. <laughs> they love doing they that. Love they love saying they were a they, slut. They yeah. love like being like, oh my God, it's so promiscuous. Not like, slut shaming. No. But they always love making everyone be like, I'm down for a good time. <laughs> <laughs> my name's Sam. <laughs> <laughs> like all, like they were really aggressive. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you were on a date, right, and someone's like, "Do you want to see what I can do?" I flip. I'd be like, "No." Nah. I'd be a bit embarrassed. Yeah, <laughs> He's coming out the bush again. I don't know what he's saying. I'm looking for a guy with a solid foundation. Ooh. Aww. This is my guard dog, Winston. He keeps the queens and the 
flavors away from me. The cream? It I keeps think, cream I away think, from me. I think so, Queen's. What, rewind that bit? He keeps the cream away from me. What? It's my guard dog, Winston. He keeps the queens and the flavors away from me. Queens and players, does he say? I'm very confused. I'm my baby coming out party. Bring on the mom! That's not a good match. Hi, I'm Justine. I'm 45 years old. And I'm Chris and I'm 20. More energy, Justine! <laughs> yeah, Justine, scream! Come on, scream! <laughs> I want your throat to not work by the end of this. <laughs> Give us as much energy as all those diamonds on your blouse. <laughs> 45 year old with a 20 year old. That's a young mum. That right? is a young mum. I always used to wear polo tops. Is that polo? I don't even know what they're called anymore. Polo? I know, but they were like five pounds from H and M. Henny's and yeah. Murat, and they always have stripes on. Always have stripes on. So uh, I don't think this is a good match. I don't think it's a good match at all. I don't. Well, think we don't it know because it's a date in the mum. It's a shame yeah. they don't get to see him and be like, oh, you know what? Don't bother. Yeah, you know what? I heard him screaming and flipping through yeah, the garden by and, the yeah. pool. <laughs> and I am working my ass to get him some ass. Hell yeah! Woo! <laughs> Hi, I'm mortified. I absolutely. I'm gonna cry. Mortified. <laughs> They told them to I, say it. There's no way. Actually, maybe like hell yeah. Yeah, they they must have. They've obviously given them them lines, but I think to come on a show like this, like you, you have, have to, to be like a fun yeah, man yeah, anyway. yeah, yeah, true. Yeah, look, I mean, she's she fun. Look, she's just doing this. That's an effect, not me. <laughs> Angel's not a bachelor with me and my mom. She's my best girlfriend. Just 25 years older. Was that necessary? Yeah. Yeah. Even more Are they literally playing dice? I think they're just is dice game. again. It's not called like crubbage. <laughs> oh, is it? No, that's crubbage. That's crubbage. Oh, Yahtzee! We're gonna win because we're hotter than Paris' sex tape. That's hot. <sighs> I tell you, Daddy. Now it's time to try a mommy. Bring up mom number one. Oh, he's absolutely handsome. unbearable. I can't stand it. He is. This unbearable. has to be scripted because no one is that. Like, no. like, if it's surely not, no. right? I don't believe that his like. That. They're fed lines for sure. Yeah. And, but, I, I don't know. What are you going to tell this guy? I'm going to tell him the truth. I'll make you sound like Celine Dion. I don't sound like Celine Dion. Don't say that. How about your beautiful smile? That's fine, because I know it's beautiful. Wait, I'm going to tell him the truth. You sound, sound like, like Celine, Celine Dion. Dion. Is that what she said? I think so. Kevin, <laughs> <laughs> hello. Hello. <laughs> Tell him I love football sports. Why? Because of the tight pants? No, Mom. Gays can like football, too. Uh, that's script. not true. No. That's very scripted. <laughs> that's very scripted. That's very scripted. No, of course, a jack. A quarterback or a receiver? Does everything sex with you, Mom? Yes. I think we're getting into a date right about now. I... I'm looking for something like a committed relationship. So if I find out that you made the impression that I'm a slut, there's gonna be problems. I'm sitting here like I'm getting reprimanded all day. <laughs> you know, any other time, I'd kick your ass already. I can't even believe you're sitting here acting so. <laughs> <laughs> So back then there was a real thing about being a slut. Wasn't yeah, there? like oh hey sluts, like mm. everyone kind of have a mm. slut. And, but then you'd also like slut shame people for being slut, mm. and uh, it was a very weird. Like it was a, a word that I feel like would have been word of the year for about five years. Paris and Nicole used to call each other slut in that show. Hey slut. Good luck, mom. Oh, I hope I have a nice time. I'm so. You're gorgeous. I'm just I'm Justine. I'm Sam. Nice to meet you. What are we gonna do today? Well, I'm a diver and a swimmer, and we're gonna go take a water room class. We're gonna go get wet. Great, I'm ready. Ready? Right. Diver, swimmer, makeup artist, yeah. slut, slut. <laughs> acrobat, acrobat. Okay. Gardener, Gardener. plant enthusiast. Yes, plant walker through her. Right, cool. I know a fun mom when I see one, and I see one. I wonder how far away they are from a microphone. That's what I was just thinking, though. It has it, to be a good yeah. meter. No, what's the but meter? But they'd be using like a boom. Like this. Yeah. Yeah. Sam is so hot. That boom coming out. Justine, what's your son's name? Christopher. All right, well, let's go inside to get changed. I'll meet you by the pool. You got it. Thanks. I brought Justine to the pool to show off my body. Sam, Mark, 
Are you ready for your water aerobics class? Have your instructor? I am. Hey. I'm sorry, but look. It's so script. It's like yeah, yeah, horribly scripted. scripted. You wouldn't. You wouldn't do that. Wait, who's that? Oh, it oh. was <laughs> incredible. Tell me everything. His name is Sam. We did water aerobics. <laughs> really? He wore this tight Speedos. Oh, my God. His ass is so tight, Chris. I mean, he was hot. But there was one little problem. The instructor, he was really hot. And Sam thought he was hot. Yeah. Scripted. It's very but, planned yeah. out. But that is a yeah. good red flag. That's a good red Well done, Mum. To say in front of Chris, Mum won. <laughs> <laughs> respect, re respect, perspective date, perspective date, Perspect perspective, perspective okay. date, future date. Uh, what? Did you block I told him he was a slut. In fact, I told him he the trash can. I quit. <laughs> <laughs> so do you think you were going to win, Mom? Yes. I think he's going to pick you. <laughs> Thanks so much. You're welcome. I'm 41. Hi, I'm Dominic, and I'm 21, and we're ready to find me a man. Face looking nice, mum and They do. They got their cocktails in glasses outside her front house, the front of her house. I feel like Americans do a lot on their front porch and their front garden instead of. I feel like people don't mind doing that. We just wouldn't do it because we don't want people to see us or socialize with people. But in England, do you ever see? I feel like American front gardens are bigger than. Am I ready to meet mom number two? Absolutely. So are you excited? Yes. He you better be cute. I know. He is. But I'm worried. I hope that he is not a jealous type. I hope that he can go to the clubs and be okay with me being a tramp. You're a hot tramp. Right well, then you're not ready to date, then, are you? Yeah, you're not ready. You're not ready, Han. Han. You poor mother. At the club. Oh, thank <laughs> you. <laughs> What's that, a cat? Is that a dog? Uh, I like my eyebrows waxed, like Carmex, and my toenails cut. Anything else? One more thing. Make sure he has a cute butt. Can you imagine, like, Carmex? He like that's what he likes his eyebrows <laughs> I don't know, I don't and know about Carmex. That. Yeah, that? he loves it. <laughs> okay. <them>. Right. Mm. <laughs> Okay. Sorry about that. I mean, it's not a bad thing, but why is that a personality? He's a makeup that... artist, so you can't be like, oh, that's so feminine. You're a makeup artist. Like, back then, that yeah. was, that's like super, like. <sighs> but why, like, why would you tell someone. Sorry. Sorry. Like, tell me, tell me three things about yourself. And, like, my Carmex. eyebrows are like, Carmex, Carmex. <laughs> like, why is Carmex like a something you do? Do you want some water? No, I, the Pepsi's up here now, it's dripping down my throat. Right, brain. leave it, leave it. Oh, he's here. <laughs> Bye, have fun. Remember, cute bubble butt, okay? Cute little squishy butt. Hey, what's going on? Hi. Hi, my name's Sam. I'm Anna, how are you? I'm doing great today, how are you doing? I'm doing fine. Hi. How are you? Oh, I'm gonna feel like a date. Fun. What's his name? His name is Sam. Was he cute? He was gorgeous. Cute butt? Yes. Really? Like, he's everything. Really? I had a date with him and his dog. Uh-huh. His dog? Oh, and you're Did you tell him I don't like dogs? I'm kind of dog-phobic. Gone. Gone. Bye. Basically, forget you. Okay. I hope, I hope you have a nice life. Well, I kind of said you'd have to choose Dominic, and you'll find out whether he likes dogs or not. Yeah, was that dog in the background? Hi, I'm Debbie, I'm 55. Hi, I'm Jared, and I'm 19. No, he's not. No way you're 19, sir, no. <laughs> All right, decision time. <laughs> you said your son looks like Ricky Martin. But you also said he's trampy, and I don't date sluts. So unfortunately, I do not want to date your son. Sam, Winston's a better man than you'll ever be. Meet my handsome son, Dominic. Ricky Martin. <laughs> <laughs> you lost this one. Get that queen of tiara. I'm looking what did he? What, wait, story, what did he just say? Get that queen of tiara. Oh. Is <laughs> I wonder if they tell me like they're like be really shitty with they each other. They must do. Yeah. I, I, I find that really strange. It's, yeah. it's like uncomfortable to watch a little bit. Yeah. Maybe. I feel like it's acting. It must all be acting. Debbie, Jared sounds like my type, but I can't date a guy who sharpens his eyebrows. So I'm sorry. I do not want to date your son. 
Sam, I'm telling you, you're going to be really sorry. Need my handsome son, Jared. Sam! See, that was nice. Like, you're going to be yeah, really sorry. You're, Not like, you're a fuck it. I fucking hate, hate yeah. you and your whole family. Meet my son. You're garbage. <laughs> Get all that stuff out of here. You're like, give him a filthy look. Yeah. Sam, Zoolander, and those eyebrows! Justine? You said Chris is an amazing guy looking for a healthy and committed relationship. Sounds like we have a lot in common. Justine, I do want to date your son. Yes! Oh, what if he's like, no. Sam, you <laughs> turned me on, and I know you're going to turn my son on. Meet my gorgeous son, Chris. No! No! <laughs> don't get in the dog's face like that when you first meet him. Yeah, don't be rude. Hey Sam, you know what they say about the size of a man's dog? Size of a man's dog? Oh. Don't be horrible about a dog. Why are they pretending? Oh, the dog went in I don't, I too, don't then. think they would have dated after that. I think that would have been I it. don't think they would have dated. I don't think any of that was real. No. Um, and it was just really shit. It was actually. really, really shit. It was very, oh. like, I know the usual episodes were probably like, fifth, well, with American adverts, probably like 20 minutes yeah, long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's just a lot of shouting the whole, there was so much going on. It was really rude. They're like, they were really rude to each other. They were. It's like, like why would I want to It's watch like, them? I want to date you. I don't want to. Well, you're fucking horror. Like, yeah. It's like, you were, you were wanting to date them and now I know you fucking hate fucking them. Yeah. yeah. I don't. This this show is worse though. Let's next. move on to next. Yeah. Next is that one where they come out the bus and we're like, my name's whatever. And I like, Dix. Oh. <laughs> no, they're, they're a bit more like, um, like promiscuous, promiscuous yeah. in that. Yeah. Um, and then sometimes they come out the bus and the person will be like, you know what? You're not my type. Get out of here. Yeah. And like next. nothing, next. Yeah. And like nothing would even happen. And then they'll go on the bus and discuss with the other people like, yeah, here's ugly. ugly. Yeah. You're gonna fucking hate yeah. him. Yeah. I don't want to have to, yeah, good for you. Yeah. Okay, guys, get ready to go one on one. Okay, so she's the subject. Okay. Oh, okay, fine. Okay. I'm Anji, I'm 19, and I'm a pre med student, so I really know oh. my way around a naked body. I'm Justin, I'm 19, and I'm black and Italian, so I may be the first real Italian stallion. Was that real? Yeah, yeah, she's no. that. And I'm hot enough to get away with saying that I love Ryan Seacrest. Oh, so, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Eddie and I'm 20 and I'm hot enough to say I love, I love Ryan Seacrest. But what do you do, Eddie? Do you even like Carmex? Yeah. Like, like what are we gonna... I don't... What do you do with your eyebrows? Yeah. Are they Sharpie? I'm Brian. I'm 25. Once this girl sees my baby blues, she'll forget what color hers are. I'm Carl. Tasteful. Fine. I'm 21 and I play college baseball, so I can't wait to show this girl my big back. <laughs> Harassment. She's only 19. I'm a skydiving instructor. Oh, there's a lot of it. I, I don't remember there being this many guys and girls. I thought it was like three people. Mm, I remember I remember there being a lot, but I remember the turnaround being really quick. Yeah, no, you're right, yeah. Oh, you guys are so good. Oh, and they're really rude to each other yeah, as well. Yeah, they were like, you suck. Yeah, you look like... Garbage. Garbage. <laughs> so, what do, you, uh, what do you do? Studying for... I, Ryan Seacrest. <laughs> <laughs> Rice Seacrest enthusiast. Medical student. <laughs> <laughs> Although I haven't taken a fashion class yet. Fashion. I do fashion things, although I haven't taken a fashion class. He believes he deserves her curves. But for the reserve, hope he'll get served a next. Guys, it's about that time. I'm going first. Oh! I'm... Here's my favourite so far. Yeah, I want him I, to do yeah, well. Yeah, let's hope. Uh, hmm. All right, Jack. He, did that guy just smack his ass he on the did, way out? He did, he did. I don't, I think you're on the wrong episode. We're watching you, fashion class secrets. Yeah. Chances are. Who, Keanu? <laughs> <laughs> Hope she's down to play doctor. Premier student, great. Speaks Speak Mandarin. Mandarin. Perfect. Speaks Speak with Winnie Pooh Bear. That's fine. Hi. Hi, 
Hey there, I'm Anji. Alex, nice to meet you. What is the stuff you got here? What's all this? <laughs> I've not seen that before. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna play basketball and rollerblade. Yeah, and she's he's gonna like maybe fool or miss a hoop. And she's be like, you know what? You're not enough you know what? for me. You can't put your ball in my hoop. Where your your yeah. ball smell. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, actually, um, I'm a trainer at a club. Personal so. trainer. Looks like you got a better six pack than I do. So that's good. What do you think its chances are? He might not come off. I thought that was the next moment. Though. Yeah, I, I thought was she was going to be that. like, no man can. I don't know. I don't need to whip you into shape, like she said. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like instantly as being wonderful, but as soon as he like warms up and opens up and stuff, I'm sure that she'll just love him. So. What kind of music do you listen to? I know it Aww. sounds trite to say everything, but I kind of do listen to everything. You like country? Ooh, by everything I meant everything but country. I think. Oh, because that's my favorite kind of music. Oh. So I'm gonna have to say next. Oh, oh no. no! You can, you can, you can. Yeah, I feel like that would have gone either way though, because you, I feel like you either love or hate country music. Yeah. So I feel like whatever answer could have been a bit of a dodgy one. Yeah. And you can, and you can, you can. You don't have to like the same music as your. Yeah. Other. And if you like, you can learn to love it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think she's missed out there. I made four dollars. I guess. Like so they get the money, money for every minute. Right. Okay. okay. Can you imagine? I don't like country music. Well, you have a tiny penis. Get out! Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually really into this. I'm more into this than I thought I would be. Yeah. <laughs> Thinks he looks like Lenny Kravitz. Claims to fall in love easily. Grabs gear shift to relieve road rage. What, what does, does that mean? mean? Hello. Hi. I'm Allison. Hi, Justin. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So what's up? We're gonna play some basketball and uh, we're gonna rollerblade at the same time. Game on. So guys, how did you all lose your virginities? Do you smell? Aww. Nice. Well, it depends. What do you mean? And if you like smokers or non-smokers. If I like smokers or non-smokers? Well, do you smoke? Yeah, I actually do. And I have to say next. Did he get $26? Why, why would you ever admit to smoking to someone who's clearly... Oh, no, health. this health. Yeah, yeah, I wonder if she told him. I hope I'm man enough for her. Hollis employee yeah, that yeah. says, okay, right. Idolizes Ryan Seacrest, eats chocolate three times a day. Oh, hello, Hi there. Hi. You're Allison? Yes. Eddie, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Oh, look what we have here. Yes, are you hungry? Oh, I can eat. I have I told uh, this isn't I think he's a bit too flamboyant. This, this, this isn't this isn't this isn't this isn't I think she's looking he seems lovely, but I think she's looking for somebody who's a bit more stereotypically man. man. Hi, Hi. Nice to meet you. He eats like me? Yeah, you like that. <laughs> 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 This has to be an actor. He wasn't acting this stereotypically no. like fe feminine. They've added him in. The, in yeah, in, sure. in the thing. I love going out shopping. I love coordinating outfits. Sorry, I have to be. I'm talking with my mouth open. That is okay. I'm so sad right now. She was exactly what I would do if I built a woman. Stop. It's okay, bud. This was it. Stop. No. 24 minutes and he's like... No. It's like she wasn't willing to compromise, you know? I'm sure there was things wrong with her that I would have compromised. Yeah. Her. I don't understand that. I don't understand that. Smoking is a pre Even back then, smoking was still a pretty big deal. Yeah. Like, who who smokes nowadays? Yeah. God, you know, you gotta trust you have a big heart. Very sensitive for us. Think like this can't be real. No. This can't be real. No. Crying after 24 minutes. I know. Don't worry, man. I cried over a girl several times. Don't worry, man. Cry. Really? Yeah. yeah. Sorry, dude. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, this is all acting. It's too much. Too much. Of course, man. How much clothes do you own? Yeah, this is acting. Oh my goodness. But I mean, it's it's not something that you know I want to brag about. It's something that I'm passionate about. You know? Yeah. And something that I care about. Do you like to shop too? I do like shopping. Oh, good. But I don't know if I like shopping as much as you. Um, well, that's fine. Everybody has their own might hobbies. Be, might be a little much. I'm gonna have to say next. Don't worry. I'm tough. Allison, 
You should have picked me. You could have bought some of my t-shirts. Eddie was more flame broiled than my hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> Played the piano for seven years. Good. Terrified of large, mean women. Fantasizes about the Little Mermaid. She's 13. And here's 25. How you doing? Hi. I'm Brian. Allison, nice to meet you. Allison, nice to meet you too. I'm a little over the burgers, but we have some fruit. So I thought we can match on some of that while we get to know each other. Oh, very good. Very good. I'm like, no, thank you. Grapes give me the shit. Uh, <laughs> no, thank you. A pineapple <laughs> makes my poo turn to oil. <laughs> I'm a master beatboxer. That's what I am. Master beatboxer. Master beatboxer. Cause I'm gonna do it, do it. Cause I'm gonna do it. Do it. No. Really I hate girl, I don't care for beatboxing. It was good, but I just hate group projects. Yeah, like, like uh, people joining in, yeah. looking at each other. Yeah. How much preparation I went into this. I coordinated all these outfits. You know what, Eddie? Uh, that seemed like a whole lot of effort to put into dressing for a straight guy. So uh, what's the deal, man? Eddie, are you gay? Oh, come on, I, Eddie. I am not gay. Okay. Eddie, come I'm on. incredibly straight. You will never meet another man who is more comfortable with his sexuality or secure with his masculinity or lack thereof. You're the gayest straight guy I've ever met. Oh, well, thank you. I am incredibly happy, if I may say. I'm so, his, oh, his, that's an actor. He's been playing it up to you. Yeah, much. but only since the date. Yeah. Before, he was like, oh, you're a bit suspicious. Yeah. And now he's like acting like he's in an opera. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's an actor. Well, back in these days, they always use gay people as like a comedy yeah, relief they did. all the time. Yeah, they did. And where are we going? Well, I'm really into guys with good hygiene, so we're gonna take you to the dentist and see what you got in there. The dentist. I can't wait. Well, I had a great time with you. Um, you have a great smile, great teeth. You've been with me for 56 minutes. You can either take the $56 or go on a second date. I would love to go on a second date with you. Yeah. Oh. yeah, he yeah, he's a night nice, apart from the little mermaid and big mean women. Yeah. His his He nice. seems nice. Yeah. There's a few things I would never do on a first date, and that is eat in front of a person. Yeah. And spit into a cup. I do this. Yeah. So we have next again, but this is the gay guys one. <laughs> I feel like this I remember this being more Violent. Um, violently, aggressively, <laughs> verbally aggressive. Yeah. Okay, we have Evan, 21. I'm 21, and I'm an artistic, fun-loving gay man. So passion is very close to my heart. I love to sing and dance. It's so much fun. <laughs> I haven't found the right guy yet. Believe me, I've tried quite a few of them out. The next class is pulling in with five different guys. I can't wait to see which one I'm going to pull out. I'm Alex, I'm 18, and this guy won't say next when he sees my package. I'm Carlos, I'm 20, and beware boys, my ass is fabulous. I'm Christopher, I'm 19, and I'm gonna win because I've got a d like a giant sequoia. I'm Jeff, I'm 18, and this guy's gonna pick me, and as crazy as my hair is. I'm Keith, I'm 20, and guys love me because I look corruptible. Because I... Can so. Oh, it's a bit Houston. Can we just say that this, the editing throughout this one and the first one isn't Marx's editing? No, or MTV. <laughs> I yeah. think someone's adding. <laughs> yeah. Hi, I'm Evan. Alex. You have a really weak handshake, so I have to say next. You're really ugly, and it's your last bitch. <laughs> Never you the loser here. You're really fucking ugly. <laughs> <laughs> one minute, one dollar. Maybe I'll buy Evan some Rogaine. Alex's handshake felt like a limp. <laughs> Maybe the boys on the bus can find a way to help Alex strengthen his grip. Certain architecture has never had a boyfriend. Girls think he's straight. No, they don't. That's not that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not do that. Nice to meet you, Evan. How are you doing? Doing okay. How about yourself? Very good. I like to dance, and I like all types of dance. We have some African dancers over here ready to show us some steps. Would you like to try it? Sure, let's go. 
<laughs> I thought he was a dancer. Yeah. Neither of them are doing a great, Neither, but the dates yeah. do better than the nurses yeah, as a dancer. Exactly. How I just can't imagine somebody like Rosina, so I'm like, I can't, not the first not time. The first time we meet. His, the guy they're dating isn't very likable in no. general. He seems like a really horrible person. I don't know why they've picked him as like, yeah. uh, the, like the main thing. I work with autistic children oh, okay. and, and help them, you know, dysfunction throughout the day and, and learn basic functional skills. And... That's definitely cool. It shows that you also have a caring side and down to earth. You're not shallow nor stuck up. Shallow well, nor stuck up. <laughs> Kind of, and not really. Like, I'm out to my friends, and part of my family knows, except my mom and dad. I'm a big family person, and it's important to me that, that whoever I'm with be open and honest with their family, because I not only want to be accepted by them, by their family as well, so that there's no awkwardness. So I have to tell you next. Mm. It's a different situation, I don't think, it? yeah, it's, I mm. appreciate, um, mm. Mm. Terrified of food poisoning, enjoys hanging out with his speedos, wax the man's hairy back. I'm a strict vegetarian, okay? And I love trying new places. This place beef is all raw food. Search vegetarian? That's what I thought he said. Did he say strict, but just really weirdly? Maybe. Maybe he's a strict. I'm a strict vegetarian. Oh, that doesn't look too bad. What was your last relationship like? Um my last relationship Lord had a wonderful body excellent looks but just mentally wasn't stable to me claimed to be an exorcist that's a little interesting yeah absolutely kind of freaky actually I would be like take me with you on my yeah, exorcism let's go see them let's do that then <laughs> and I also strip at the breast so um, I'm not hired there but um, they told me to get up there and do that Absolutely, be a stripper. Do whatever you great, want to do, but make sure you're getting paid. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't think you can like, say you dance somewhere, but then be like, oh well, actually, I just go Imagine. there for a night out. I'm a makeup artist, but I don't actually. I just pin people down and do their makeup. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> make sure you're getting paid. Get paid. I'm a little bit uncomfortable with the whole stripping thing. Definitely not my scene. So I'm really sorry, but I have to stay next. Well, well you're out. <laughs> I mean, I know the guy they're dating is a bit of an asshole, yeah. but he's been told it's ugly. Yeah. He's been told that he needs to use Regain for his hair. He's oh. been told he needs a pedicure. Yeah, he's not having the best time. He's not having the best time. I used to wear girls' jeans all the fucking time. They're better fit. They were better time fit back then. But... Yeah. How are you doing? Hello. My name's Jeff. Evan. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How's it going? It's going pretty well. So what do you do? I work at a Christian camp. Okay. I like tutor children and do drama. Do you say what's a Christian camp? Yeah. Production stuff. Okay. So you're really into religion? Yeah, I'm really into religion. I want to continue at like my Christian university and uh, something I really believe in. Uh, how do you feel about like the whole um, gays going to hell? God forgives people for their sins. Being gay, they say, is a sin. Stealing is a sin. God forgives people for stealing. God forgives people for being gay. Because you believe that, I really have to say next. That would I be agree with for me there. too. It's, it's like, you know, have your beliefs, whatever, but don't. I, it's a bit, it's a bit, what's the word? I don't know, I feel like we, uh, contradictory. contradictory. I feel like they'd constantly think we're living a life of yeah, sin. Yeah, you'd be like, aren't you happy with life? Well, it is a sin, but, but God forgives. You know, yeah. That'd be really uncomfortable. God may forgive you for being gay, but no one is going to forgive you for that haircut. Jeff thinks that... <laughs> 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 Keith, Tony. Afraid of bargain shoppers. He's literally dressed exactly like all the yeah. other people. Well, I'm glad to hear that you went to cosmetology school. Um, that's something that we have in common. So we're gonna go play with some hair and, and makeup and have a good time. Great. Kind of reminds me of like a bad 80s prom. Yeah. You cut up quite a bit of hair here. Good haircut. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I've had a wonderful time hanging out with you. I think uh, you're a really great guy. 
and you've been on the date with me for 43 minutes, and you have a choice to either take the $43, or you can go on a second date with me. It's up to you. Take the money. Two queens are good in poker, but they're not good in a relationship. I'm gonna have to take the money and go back to the bus. Oh. <laughs> not quite as much fun when the tables have turned. I guess my search continues. So this is Room Raiders. I kind of remember it. I think I do. Don't they go around and looking in people's rooms? Yeah, and they, so the person they want to date goes to their rooms and looks around, and I think if they choose one at the end of it. Uh, and I always remember being horrified, like, you knew we were going to be on this. Why did you not tidy your room? No, don't they come to the house and, like, pull them out? But yeah. Like, oh! Do they? So it's, like, unexpected. Yeah. No. Yeah. Not with her makeup like that. She knows. Of their lives. When they find out <laughs> yeah, true. Picked for a date, not by their looks or charm, but by what's inside their No. Pants. The girls watch helplessly as their dirtiest secrets are revealed. Oh my god! Oh boy. What is he doing? Uh, Put it down. A notebook. Oh my god! <laughs> but, like, and also, like, what if they don't even like the guy and he's just mm. going for their shit? The coolest thing about where I live is that I have a graveyard across the street from my house. That's, this is gonna sound terrible, but I would love in my house to have a graveyard across the street. <laughs> but what if old graveyard was under your house? Why would it be under your house? Well, because sometimes if the graves are really old, they just like, they're like, oh, whatever. There's just, some, there's just something very scenic about yes, them. Yes, I agree. You know what I mean? Yeah. Not like that, not to hang out in. No, I'd be more respectful. respectful. But they just, they just look. Yeah, no, I agree. Most important qualities I look for in a boyfriend probably the humor sensitivity. If they dress like me, it's definitely a plus. Because I'm not going to be <laughs> my name is Peach, and I'll be choosing one of you for a date today. Oh my god! But I don't get to see or speak to you before I choose. But I do get to go through your rooms and see what you're like before I make my decision. So I hope you guys clean up. Oh my god. That's not that yeah, cool. That's so no. Alright. Room number three. This neighborhood looks pretty nice. Alright, so there's a cemetery across the street. I'm looking forward to her room the most. Yeah, I am too. It's uh, pretty spooky. Let's check out the uh, old B.O. Toyota. That baby works really good. Looks pretty cool. I, uh, I honor diversity as well. Do brownie point for him. Aww. The house is looking pretty nice. It's uh, got a large front porch here. It's a nice house. Mm. I'm excited. Not bad. This looks like a very comfortable house. Very, uh, it's a perfect opposite graveyard. Absolutely. Decor. Yeah. Uh, old fashioned. The parents. Let's go talk to them. Get them, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we have an artist in the house. I thought they went to remove all the pictures of them. Well, I've seen uh, I know. downstairs. Is that her? Mm. Mm. What is your style? I don't think he has a style. But uh, it's comfortable enough, you know, so. Move on. Well, See, he seems like a nice he guy. Seems fair. Yeah. yeah. I'm actually gonna get, you know, dive heads in here and uh, try to find out what color her hair is, because that's very important. Ew! If it's red, it's mine. Oh my god, no. That this is the family home yeah, as well. I thought it was like, just a room, like get her yeah. hair from a pillow. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Light brown reddish. Oh my god! <laughs> wow. Huh. This is a pretty cool room. Ceilings and lots of posters. Whoa, lots of dolls and a uh, couple Barbies. Whoa, blindfolded, and then one can see <laughs> this Barbie. She did a little dyeing of the hair, taped her up. I'm spraying her legs, and uh, she's ready to go. <laughs> My god, <laughs> she seems to be uh, really into uh, animation and uh, gothic clothing. There's a little uh, frog hat. <laughs> <laughs> Wants to, you know, change her hair color. I'm saying it's the same thing in the background. Just slap on a pink wig. You look so sexy. I don't know. This seems really out of place. <laughs> <laughs> Craig David. <laughs> this girl's been very, very naughty. Whoa. 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 Who
here decided that uh, she needed to be tied up. Oh, no, what happened to her? Perhaps uh, she's the type of person that could later get into s and <laughs> I'm not into s and myself, but uh, I think that uh, people should be able to do whatever makes them happy. I'll, I'll meet you with the whip, honey. Oh, which is lovely. <laughs> and if s and makes people happy, then oh. so be it. Oh. She likes to keep an image, judging from all the makeup. Oh, the shoes! Are they sketches? Oh, they cute! Is that an S or is that just a pattern? Wow, this is so good. There's nice colors. Oh, wow. and this girl's a visionary. Aww, that was really nice. Whoa! <gasps> that was placed. Fantasy. <laughs> See, this gets a little naughty. Oh, oh, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> she had lots of dolls that were bound and gagged and looked like they were beaten maybe a little bit. So <laughs> I don't really want her to do that to me ever. Uh, so that's a cause for concern for myself. Okay, so he's done all their rooms. It, this clip actually skipped everyone else. But they they now get a chance to go and look in his room and find his dirty, dirty his pornography. Let's check out the kitchen. There's a fucking mess! All over the fridge. Oh, open the fridge. Alright, let's see what's in there. Opening with a tissue and then she puts her hand on it. This boy lives on cheese, grape jelly, rotten peaches. No. Mom, when you need her. Oh my god. Oh. Your pillow is yellow. We just look around your yeah, and there's, yellow house. there's fungus growing in your fridge. Mm. Which is, you know, for sure if you're comfortable, but then don't make that a negative for someone else. Don't come on a show where you know what you're about to do yeah. on a pink fridge. Yeah. Artistic and well decorated as well, but there was uh, dolls and stuff that were tied up and that was kind of weird. You can presume that is. that is. She doesn't sleep on her bed, it's just to hang out on. Yeah, her. okay. A lot of people just sleep on the floor. Yeah. Alright, <laughs> 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 Not leave me. Right. Hello. <laughs> I'll meet you. Yes. I wasn't expecting to be She's cute. Yeah, yeah, she's yeah, cute. Cool so, I'm You know, that was a lot nicer than the other ones. Yeah. The other ones yeah, really made me like, uh Yeah, it that, was was too much. that was a nice ending, although yeah. they, I'm sure they didn't really stay together. But yeah. <laughs> nice. But let's throw the comments if you remember any of these dating programs and what you think of them, because they were horrible. <laughs> <laughs> but some of them were good. Oh, oh, them. <laughs> some of them were very uncomfortable to watch. Yeah. But you know what? That's life back in the 90s, early 2000s. Yeah, it really Uncomfortable was. to watch. Yeah, and people saying things. All right, anyway. <laughs> That's good. I, 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 I will see you next time. Bye. Bye.